C, I'm going to teach you how to find certain colors and people with a colored hat like I have that is red and white. You understand? Great. Great. Frederick, what are you doing here? So, this is great. I'm trying to teach our friend here with the capabilities of our latest deep learning and ArcPIC 8 and the open platform to recognize people with certain colors. I'm developing a, a new ACAP. I'm going to call it Find Frederick. Seems like a really interesting use of your time. Why don't we leave the camera and the book here and I can go tell you about our partner ecosystem. We have hundreds of partners that are building applications just like this that could really help you out. Wow, great. Yes, looking forward to it. Let's go. Hello again and welcome to yet another episode of the Axis Network. Today we're going to talk about something that I find very exciting and that is intelligence at the edge and how Axis work with partners to accomplish that. And for that we have as a guest Alex Walters who is managing our technology integration program. Welcome Alex. Hi, Alex, Frederick. how are you? Good thanks, thanks for having me today. Welcome to my studio or our studio here. Yeah. Um, I was thinking about it the other day. You've been around a little bit more than 10 years at the time when you joined. We launched the first Axis camera application platform. Uh, how has it developed over those 10 plus years? Yeah, when I started, uh, I, I remember ArtPEC 4 being the big new innovation, and now we're on ArtPEC 8, so a lot of new features and functions and capabilities uh, for our devices. And with ACAP, we're now on ACAP version 4 as well, and yeah. this allows for computer vision and machine learning and deep learning applications to be done directly on the device itself. Yeah, so a lot of exciting development. And we have how many partners in our technology integration program today? Yeah, so the program globally has a little bit over 600 partners um, okay. and we're getting new applications into the program daily and people can join by going to the Access website, looking up the technology integration partner program uh, and applying directly online. So what's the latest trend? We've done it for a long time and it's developing very, very quickly. We talked about deep learning a little bit. What are the other trends we're seeing? Yeah, I think in another trends, and we see this across the industry, cloud is a big thing, mm -hmm. artificial intelligence is a big thing. I think particularly when we look at our VMS partners, our, our video management system partners, we see them shift to cloud and, and shift to moving things off-prem and doing it in different hybrid ways. And uh, we see a lot of applications where they're doing more than just video management. They're managing devices and events and activity and intercom and audio and access control and mm -hmm. radar and all sorts of other different applications. And now a lot of that is being done in the cloud where we can help give them some device management support. So are there any new type of companies that are coming into the program that now see interest in our market here? Yeah, I, I think uh, we use a, work a lot with these kind of IoT hyperscalers, right? Yeah. Companies like Microsoft. And, and so we have a, a new application now where we can send our cameras and our devices directly into the Microsoft Azure Cognitive Services platform. And from there, their development ecosystem can build all sorts of different kinds of applications. And, and this is really opening up a lot of new possibilities for us. Uh, I think when we talk about the sky is the limit, but this cloud computing is limitless possibility. If you look at application wise, it sounds like a lot of new opportunities are being opened up for this, right? Yeah, and that's, not only in security. Exactly, yeah, the, the, the core function of the technology integration partner program is to add functionality to our devices and to our, our systems uh, beyond what Access currently has in the portfolio. And, and we see this kind of exciting new shift where there's a lot of new applications that are what we call beyond security. Yeah. It's no longer just safety and, and, and security, but this operational efficiency. Um, for example, we have companies that are using our cameras at assembly lines at manufacturing plants to make sure that all of these parts and pieces got put together and, and done the right way so they can do quality assurance and make sure that whatever they're building is being done properly. So what I take from this is that new capabilities, new partners and new applications. Uh, and that reminds me, I haven't really wrapped up my own applications, Find Frederick yet. So do you want to help me with that? Yeah, absolutely. I still have a little bit of testing, so let's go and make sure, sure we train it a little bit better. Okay, let's get the equipment on to make sure it has the right capabilities. Yeah, let's go.
I think it's ready to be uploaded. All right, here goes. Ha! Yeah. Done. Nice.